Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ali. If you're new to my channel, and welcome to Beauty with a Purpose. And if you are new to my channel, my name is Ali. I upload three videos a week lifestyle, beauty, and Bible. And they will be posted three times a week at 10 a.m. Now, with all of that being said, let's go ahead and get into today's video. Okay, so today I have for you guys, it's like a mini, hold up. Hold up. So it's like a mini Amazon haul slash little mini review. So let's just go ahead and jump right into it. And the first thing I'm going to start out with, because I forgot to put it in, because I'm trying to see if this is something I want permanently before I make the commitment, because it's a big commitment, because it's a hole in your face. So I did go ahead and pick up these little fake nose rings. This was a pack of six and it, it was the cheapest one. It's like $4.99 and it has all different kinds of color. You can get the packs of all silver and all gold, but they do cost a little bit more. I've already lost like my gold gold one yesterday at the gym. I forgot about it and I went into the steam room and then when I got out, I went to wipe my face and I wiped it out and then like I threw the paper towel in the trash and then by the time I remembered I went to look in the trash and I was like there's way too much paper towels in here for me to go through and try to find it and so it comes with these colors right here let me see if I can spread them out for you so it has like a blue iridescent one like a green purple iridescent one a black and then like a rose gold and a silver and then it also came with like this color gold but I lost that one so today I will put on the rose gold because it's the closest to what I have on today this one fits better than the regular gold one so what do you guys think like I think I'm liking it like I, think, I don't know what if I just keep buying the fake ones because I don't want to have a hole in my face because what if I get tired of it I don't know what do you guys think do you like this on me do you think it's cute like should I should I not I don't know but I like them like I said they, I think they all fit different because when I put on the gold one I had to bend it a little bit for it to fit the way I wanted now I mean it's cute you guys can see that it's cute so it's like okay for five dollars fake nose ring why not like you know what i mean like i said the hard part would just be keeping up with them and like making sure it doesn't fall out obviously i'm not used to it so i kept like hitting my nose because i would feel like something was in my nose and then i'd be like oh crap dang duh ali something is in your nose your fake nose ring so yeah i actually really do like these i think they're good quality for five bucks i mean you get six for five bucks so i mean you can't really complain and it's like it's a good way to see if this is something you'd want to commit to before actually committing to it okay and so the next thing i did or got was this okay the bag not, not oh i do need to okay so what i can show you first is this bag it actually came with this brush set and this brush set brush set okay so this brush set oh my gosh why can i not say that this brush set actually came with quite a few brushes one of them already broke and then my kids lost the handle but I do still use it. I would just have to find the piece. But it's like a bronzer contour brush. And then it came with a bunch of eye brushes and like powder brushes, foundation brush. And you guys, I really like this brush set. I cannot get enough of using this brush set. Everything will be linked down below too. too. So I, I don't know. Like I this, I really, really like this brush set. And I think it was like... 12 to 15 dollars i believe and you get a lot like there's more brushes but i have them like put in like my brow drawer because they're like brow brushes and so it comes with a lot they're really good really soft this is my favorite brush so yeah i actually have bought those like i said amazon's a really good place to look for like cheap makeup brushes cheap everything really and like i said it also came with this bag to hold them in which isn't bad because this is a really pretty bag and so the next thing that I actually have are all of these scrunchies. I got this a big old pack for $6.99. Now what I liked about these is that they weren't just plain scrunchies. They have like a little floral, floral print, but it also came with like, you know, like every color to match. And let me see. So these are all like the base colors, but I think that like some of the floral prints 
like like some of the floral prints on them are actually different like see there's the black one um the pink ones the navy blue and then you get like a darker blue and then there should be two white ones yeah two white ones and then you get these two random pretty colors and then you get oh wait look here's another pink one and then another blue one and then you get the ones that have like the little tassel on them and i thought that's why i wanted these because like i wanted some with the tassel though if you get them without the tassel you can find them even cheaper but that is what all the ones with the tassel looks like and like i said i paid 6.99 for those like i'm just really wanting to find ways where i can throw my hair up like this and today is actually a really good day for my baby hairs like they look neatly messy but it's not always a good day for my baby hairs where i do have to go in with my edge stuff and like slick my edges down and it would just be really cute to just like pop on like a little scrunchy you know what i mean and make it kick it up to the next net level and so yeah i did buy these and then i thought it was also good because during the summer like people don't really like wearing their hair down it's like the time of hair up so why not accessorize your hair it's really it's a really easy way to go ahead and like zhuzh up a look and like just make yourself look that much more put together and they are really like the little elastic part in them is actually really really good and really strong now of course i mean they're like i don't know what this material is called but it's like that see-through material i guess you could say and so obviously if you're rough with it like it will break so i literally i don't wrap it or anything i just open it and let go and since it is like the elastic is so good in there it really holds on to ponytails buns that's all i've tried it on is ponytails and buns <laughs> Okay, then the next thing, I'm just gonna start grabbing what's by me that I did, ooh, that I have picked up and it is currently on my phone are these screen protectors. Now I have the iPhone XR. Now this is what, this is the brand that it is and it was a pack of four and I think I only paid like six bucks. It comes with a thing to clean your screen, to take off the dust. You apply this to your screen so that way you can actually place the screen protector perfectly on your screen. And so I actually really liked this as well. They really do work. Like the, the actual glass will crack. Like the current one I have on has cracks in it, but my actual screen has not yet cracked. Hasn't cracked, I'm not gonna say yet. My actual screen has not cracked. <laughs> The next thing I did go in that I did pick, and it's from the brand You Can Be, and this is their belonging palette. And this is actually, when you look at it, a dupe for the um, Urban Decay Born to Run palette. There's actually another dupe floating around on um, Amazon that I will show up. And that's the one that Juicy Jazz uses, but it's a little bit more expensive than this one. So that's why I did go ahead and pick this one up. This one was only $9.99. I believe the dupe that Juicy Jazz talks about, it's $15. And then the Born to Run palette is $50. So I thought the only thing about this palette, cause I have used it a little bit, is it has a lot of fallout. Like actually on your eye, I did figure out how to work with that. You do lightly tap into this shadow, tap off the excess, and then go in with your eye. But just in the pan itself is a lot of kickback. So I've only used this palette twice, and you can see that this one already looks like it's gotten a lot of wear and tear in it. But I've actually only used the eyeshadow palette twice. Now it is good. The colors come off a little bit different than what they look in the palette. So they come off a little bit lighter. Now you can build it up to be these shades, but on the eye, they're a little bit lighter than what they look in the palette, which doesn't really bother me. Like now that I know what to expect out of this palette to know that if I go into this one, it's going to be a little bit lighter than what it looks like in the palette. You know what I mean? So yeah, but other than that, they blend really good. They're really pretty. They last a long time. They're easy to work with. If kickback and fallout and stuff like that doesn't fall, doesn't bother you, I do recommend this eyeshadow palette. And now I can take it out of the case now that I've talked about it. Okay, another thing that I have in the, um, is this little cleansing mat right here. It's really tiny, but you guys, like this little mat right here has cut my brush washing time in half. Like it used to take me like an hour to clean my brushes and now it takes me like 30, 45 minutes depending on the amount of brushes I have. Like right now I have a ton of dirty brushes, so it might take me about 30 minutes to 45 minutes, but I can get, like if I keep up with it, like wash my brushes every week, I can clean my brushes in as little as 15 minutes. So this I highly do recommend investing in one of these you can find these all over amazon i got the pink one yeah i really really liked this 
Now, the next thing we're going to talk about because I'm a little bit thirsty is this jug right here. Now, these jugs are really popular. They're floating around. I got the two liter one. They also have a one liter one and then they have the gallon one. Now, the two liter one does only cost and run you for $13. And I figured, you know what? I could fill this up twice and get my gallon. Like, let's just save the money. You know what I mean? Like, yes, it's going to, it's, it's going to take extra time, but it saves you money. I'm a little bit behind today, but since it does have like the times on here, like that motivates me. Like, okay, it's already like, for instance, right now it's 1 PM. So I need to hurry up and try to get down to here. And so it'll still encourage me. I, the first day I got this, I did go through two of these and then. The past couple of days, I got a late start, and then I'm getting a late start today. But I mean, 74 fluid ounces of water, which is two liters of water, I don't think is bad for, like, your water consumption. And you guys, like, when I started, in, like, when I increased my water intake, when I increased my water intake, you guys, it, like, my skin purged. And now it's cleaning, like, clearing up really pretty. Like, even all the breakouts I had around my chin are clearing up, and I'm so super duper flipping excited can't even like like that's how excited i am that my skin is clearing up you guys my goodness oh my lanta so the next thing i want to talk about are is this right here this is this brush holder i believe i found it for ten dollars it's like a hard plastic acrylic -y brush holder and I only have my eye brushes in here, but I liked it because if you know me, you like, you know that I like to separate things as much as possible. Like in my closet is separated. Like, I don't know. You, you, if you know me, you know, I like to separate things and organize things as much as possible. So I like that this has three compartments for my eye brushes because I can have like flat detailing brushes right here, pencil brushes and fluffy shader brushes right here. All my blending brushes back here. And so, yeah, that's why I really, really like this. And like I said, it, it's really sturdy and it has a lot of space. Like I can still fit a ton more brushes in here. So yeah, I really do recommend this too as well. The next thing I found is, bo is for both Brian and I. Everything else sadly has been mostly for me except for like the screen protectors. And I tried to get him to share these nose rings with me, but he wasn't having it. Okay, so the last thing I got, and this is for the gym, because Brian really likes to do like the squat press. I think that's what it's called, but the machine with the bar, but that bar like hurts, like hurts me. So I didn't like to use it. So I did find this for $7.99 and I got the pink one because it was the cheapest one. Like if you guys know me, you know I'm all about penny pension and so is Brian. So he don't even care that this is pink because I think the black one was like two, three dollars more than the pink one. So I just went with the pink one. It comes with the straps to make sure that it stays secure on the bar. And yeah, so I thought that this was really, really good. Like, I don't know, like it makes me excited for leg day now. Like now I'm excited for leg day to go and use this, you know, before I would be like, no, Brian, like we're not using that bar because their little dusty, crusty things that they have here fall off all the time. And no, like I like it makes it to where like I can't do as many squats as I know I can do because I'm too focused on the pain of the bar. So I thought that this was a good investment. My our gym lets us take our own like gloves and extra equipment that we may have. And so, yeah, I did just go ahead and pick this up because I was like, that's not a bad investment that we could just throw into our bag on leg day and take it with us and then bring it back home. We don't have to worry about other people messing it up. Um, yeah, so I did go ahead and pick up that as well. Okay, you guys, I'm not completely selfish. I did think about Brian and what I did pick him up because he had been asking for like, I don't know, I guess this will be good. Like if you have a man in your life, well, a black man, <laughs> an african-american man um in your life so he had been asking for like these velvet do-rags he's really like into his waves and taking care of his waves and we went to beauty stores and like we went to sally's beauty and these were running you like 12 dollars for one we went to a beauty store and it was like nine dollars for one and so i found this two pack i found this two pack on amazon for 8.99 i think it was $8.99 or $11.99, but it was way cheaper than what you would pay for. Like you get two basically for what you pay for one, like in an actual store. So I did just go ahead and surprise him with these because like I said, he's really been wanting them like just to take care, better care of his hair and stuff. So I thought, why not? Like let's surprise him and whatnot. And so I did get him those. He actually really likes them and they are soft. The inside isn't velvet, but the outside is. 
and I do see a difference in his waves using this one rather than like the ones that you just go to Walmart and pick up that are just like, I guess like, um, not silk, like a polyester, I guess you could say type of feel to them. Okay, and then the last thing that I did pick up, you guys, he had tagged me in this shirt on Facebook. And I'm kind of, like, when it comes to, like, clothes or shoes like that, like, I get kind of sketchy to buy from those type of things on Facebook. Because, A, you don't know, like, where your money's really going if you're going to re receive your product. Like, you don't know. Like, there's just so many scams on Facebook that I get scared to, like, buy stuff from them. And then, two, it usually takes you for ever to get whatever you ordered in and so he had been asking for this shirt and i actually bought it right in time not even knowing that yesterday february 21st was the anniversary of malcolm x death so he had tagged me in a malcolm x shirt on facebook and i was like you know what i'm gonna just go ahead and check amazon and i found this shirt for him and I got his size in a 2X. If you guys watch my videos, you've seen how big, like, broad Brian is. So, yeah. And he really liked it. It's really good quality. It's really nice and thick, but soft, if that makes sense. So, yeah. He really wanted this shirt. And the quote that it says on it is, the, long, the future belongs to those who prepare for it. And I was like, huh, that is a pretty good um, thing. But other than that, you guys, like that is it for this Amazon haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I don't shop on Amazon often, so I won't be able to link often. I don't really shop often. So um, if you enjoyed this, go ahead and let me know. If you have any more video, if you have any more video suggestions, comment that in the comment that down below as well also if you haven't already and you enjoyed this please go ahead and give me a thumbs up and i know you like my vibe i know you like my background so go ahead and hit that subscribe button i love you guys always remember that jesus loves you more and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys Mwah.